Well, welcome back for day three update of my wheat books only diet. Um, today I haven't had as many. Um, I'll tell you how today went. Woke up this morning, had a doctor's appointment at 11 o'clock. Finished that, come home, and I uh, had a bowl of wheat books and back to work today. Um, public holidays are finished. And so I only had one bowl of wheat books, I think about five wheat books, just before I went to work at about quarter to twelve. About 4.30, I felt like I was going to pass out, got real dizzy. Um, and so as soon as I got home, I had some wheat books. And I think the passing out stage was just not enough food in, in me, so I don't think it's the effects of wheat books only. But I did... Uh, come on with a slight headache today uh, nothing major nothing nothing that's um you know, just a couple of panic panadol took that away there was no it wasn't debilitating or anything in in any way so day three success and um well, we just got home now it's nearly 10 o'clock i feel like i'm probably going to have another four wheat books so all up today that's that's 14 wheat books about today and we just called into mcdonald's and bought my wife a burger and my kids an ice cream and i don't feel like getting one myself so there's no cravings yet just just the ones that i had on day one um yeah so we'll check you back tomorrow but please like and subscribe if you want to keep up to date remembering that i'm attempting to stay on this diet for 365 days that's one year so if you want to keep posted and um and updated subscribe and um you'll see how this diet comes along and if you're from from america or somewhere um wheat books is a breakfast cereal here in new zealand um, rated five star for being healthy, so, yeah, make sure you like and subscribe to keep up to date, and we'll see you tomorrow.